Hi everyone, this is Shivani here. Welcome to my channel, Shivani Creations. Today I am showing you how to create this beautiful threaded decoupage bottle with the handmade paper flowers. So can you see this threaded texture? This is very easy and very attractive technique. So without any further delay, let's start with the procedure. For this we need embossing pad, paint brush, groove golf tool, ball tool, green color micro pearls, green acrylic color, yellow archival ink, any thick cotton thread, white gesso, off white color chalk paint, mod podge, liquid glue, some flower cutouts, any glass bottle on which you want to do decoupage and decoupage paper. First I am taking this fruit juice bottle. This is a glass bottle. You can use any kind of bottle which is made out of glass. And now I am just adding little glue and I will start wrapping this thick cotton thread around this. You can find this thread very easily from any stationery shop or from any kirana shop. So just add little glue in small portions and start wrapping this till the end of the bottle. So I have reached till the end just cutting the excess thread and securing it. Allow it to dry for some time. It's completely dried now I will just Prime my base by applying white gesso. If you don't have white gesso, you can also use white acrylic color. Before doing any decoupage work, you need to prime your base. So, if you can find gesso easily, the best option will be gesso. Otherwise, you can just apply any white acrylic color. So it's completely covered and completely dried. Now I'm taking this beautiful floral decoupage paper. I have just cut this small portion from one corner according to the size of my bottle. And I will just do the decoupage work. Now since this decoupage paper is having three plies so we need to remove two plies like this I have removed first and now I am removing the second one and the final ply we will use as a design for our decoupage work now I am taking this Mod Podge apply a little Mod Podge spread it using flat brush and start adding your decoupage paper very slowly since this is very delicate and very thin so you have to be very patient and very careful while adhering this decoupage paper so just spread it using your fingers slowly and don't add too much decoupage or too less it should be proper so that you can stick your paper easily So just wrap this whole paper around the bottle. You can also use your paintbrush to adhere it.
so it's completely done and dried also now i'm just taking my off white color chalk paint and i will just combine my bottle and the stick podge design so that it will look like a single pattern on whole bottle it should not look like we have added one paper and the bottle is originally is something else it should look like a complete one project so just to merge these two parts i am using my off white shade which is a base color of my decoupage paper i am just using my fingers as well just to blend it very well so just coloring this bottle using off white wherever it required I am also filling this off white shade till the top of the neck of the bottle. Now I am taking this sap green color acrylic shade. and just applying it on the top neck area of the bottle and blending with the bottom of white shade so it's done now i'm taking little fevicol mod podge and this sparkle dust from dress my craft just mixing it very well using my paint brush and i will apply this mixture as a top coat or as a varnish on my bottle the sparkle dust will give you very nice shine after drying allow it to dry completely now i will proceed to make the flowers so i have already prepared these four petal flowers and i am taking yellow archival ink and this time i am not using my sponge dauber to color i am just taking one small piece of tissue paper and using that also you can just color your flowers tissue paper will also work fine So I'm just coloring from the center. Now I'm sprinkling little water from front and back. Absorb the excess water using tissue paper. Take your embossing pad. and using small size groove golf tool i will make texture from back side of the flower
so this is done just rotate your flowers and pinch in the center using ball tool in the same way i have created one small flower now i will combine all three flowers together and i will create my complete one flower now i'm adding little glue in the center and using these green color micro pearl in the center it is looking very fabulous in the same way i have created some more flowers now take back your bottle which is completely dried isn't it looking pretty i have added this small butterfly which i got from another decoupage paper and uh, it's ready to decorate so here i am first starting with white color paper doily just cutting the doily from the center this doily is a die cut doily but you can find paper doilies easily online just taking this half doily first and then i am taking some bunch of jute threads and i will add these threads to give little shabby chic look then i will add my flowers and some die cut leaves The decoration is also done isn't it looking very pretty and attractive so you can keep this bottle as it is to decorate your workspace or if you want to use it as a vase just you need to open the cap from top and you can add any natural flower bunches inside this or you can keep it as it is so my project is done for today I'm sure you have enjoyed my video. Please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos and please click on bell icon for the latest updates and notifications. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye bye guys.